Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Trufinet, the babbling Belgian, and welcome back to God of War. I'm just just standing here in the center of uh, Fafnir's storeroom, uh, just uh, appreciating how lovely this game still looks. Uh, we're gonna head back. So last time we uh, got revealed that the Reavers did manage to steal all of those stuff from the storeroom, but uh, yeah, the Reaver leader was murdered by his own son. And that son took off with the whetstone of uh, Sindri as well. So we're gonna have to head back towards Sindri and tell him that. Over some treasure? It seems so greedy. Remember what I told you, boy. You see nothing. Well, sure. He didn't seem like a great father, but. You only know half the story. Yes. Um. Well, that's a nice surprise to start the episode with. Hey, dumbass. I think I can actually just stand here. Oh no, 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 I'm on I'm pretty much on fire. Okay, those things have quite a bit of range. I'm dying. I don't know what just happened. I think I'm just gonna gonna have to retry this. There was something popping off there, wasn't it? Okay, never mind. Let's retry that. There we go. Yeah, I think that was enough, right? Yeah. Uh, let's jump on it. I don't think there's really any use to doing a heavy attack there, since you'll just. Oh, fuck me. Just gonna focus on the, the little guys at the rage for a second. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Come on, get rid of the fire. Yeah, okay, the beam. No, I'm not. I'm definitely not. Oh, God. I want to get one of those bombs. Is there any more health stones? Yeah, they're over there. They're, 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 they're. Oh, fuck, yeah. Okay. Oh, there was another one. Okay. There we go. By the skin of our teeth again. So that's Cider Sigil of Toughness increases resistance to poison by 20%. Okay. It's nice to have those ready if we want to have those later on. Probably should uh, start changing my equipment a bit, depending on what we uh, face. Ancient's Rubble. And then we have an Ancient's Heart, which is good to make the armor, and then the World Serpent's Scale. So maybe we can actually start making a bit of that armor. That would be nice. And that was a nice health stone. So, heading back. There's another Raven here as well, so if I just can get the angle on it. Circling around here somewhere. You uh, didn't happen to find that whetstone, perchance? Well, not really, Sindri. We found no whetstone. This dagger belongs to the reaver who took it. They took most of the good stuff. Oh? Well, here, take this. In exchange for the dagger. Uh, okay then. I thought he was gonna track it or something. Activate while aiming to slow down quite time. Interesting. An artless design, but the construction is sound. Where in the temple did you find this? In a river's back. Oh. Oh. He mentioned he was part of a larger clan. Maybe they took the Woodstone? Quite possibly. I know I've seen this design before. Okay. Are you gonna sh share that with us? Or is that something we're gonna be seeing later on? Yeah, it looks like Sindri has uh, stopped talking. So, uh... I also lost the raven that I saw flying around here. There it is. 
There it is. There we go. Killed it. 10 out of 51. Okay, that means we can head out again and uh, continue our exploration tour of the Lake of Nine. Port. Sorry? Port. Oh, the boat's left. Correct. Okay, so I know I need, I should have explored this way sooner than I did, but actually now that we have all the the transcription runes, the translation runes, the runes, we can actually do a bit more here as well. And I feel like there's a few other things that just force you to do something else first. Can we not get up here either? Oh come on! Never mind. Maybe on the other side. But I feel like it, it gives us a, it a bit of more flair that we're just doing all of this with a decapitated head along, along on the journey. Uh, so it doesn't seem like we can actually... There is an elevator on this side, but it doesn't seem like we can actually do anything from here. No, it seems completely locked off. So I'm wondering if that actually unlocks itself eventually while we're going through the story. What the hell is this? It seems like... Mining equipment? Okay. Okay, so there's another dock over here. And Atreus, what a stupid question. Of course we should dock here. We're docking everywhere we can. Isle of Death. That does not sound inviting. I'm just gonna check up top first. Because um, it looks like there's a cave underneath the island. Hey, it's another brazier. I suppose you wish to light it. Can I? Um, I don't know. The other spirit told us we shouldn't. We definitely shouldn't. But, uh, oh yeah, and this thing, we still can't do anything with that either. So, let's read it. Kvegia. It's always the same thing for some reason, but... Oh, God. Okay. Seems not that particularly difficult for now. Just activates frosty people. Did he just make a wall for himself? Just rolling around a bit. Seems to do the job pretty nicely. Uh, and the face. Or pretty much I'm in getting face. better. I don't believe it. Are you both alive? Okay. Another spirit. Yes, another spirit. <laughs> Hello. I can't remember the last time I saw something walk these islands that wasn't dead or corrupted. What do you mean? The desolation child. It plagues this land, growing more severe with each passing winter. Do you know its cause? Not for certain, but. I suspect the appearance of the World Serpent, along with the great flood that followed. Many were drowned, myself among them. Oh, yeah. I to walk not long after. Do you need anything from us? Boy, I only wish to speak to someone again. A wish you have just granted. Thank you. I feel like... Yeah, so it's corrupted remnant. The mystic remnant of a soul lost at sea used to upgrade the versatile warrior's handle. Oh, that's cool. So spirits freed two out of four. That, he actually <laughs> brings up a really good point that I'd never actually thought about. The, the, the first time the serpent entered the lake, it caused the water level to rise well above that building, which means that everybody who was living here just straight up died. Yeah, they, they drowned, all of those people just just drowned and the fact that there are a lot of fish over here just because the water level dropped afterwards so yeah makes a lot of sense but ugh, it's just a, a horrible thought isn't it okay lepter alloy lightning infused metal used by the king of thor used to upgrade pommels with shock damage effects oh treasure map treasure map complete 10,000 hacks silver inscribed crest of menace that sounds good Oh, so the poison resistance is actually uh, an enchantment, which is cool. Inscribed Crest of Menace is 4 of Vitality, 
and Sigil of the Axe. I'm just gonna equip that because it increases damage of all axe throws by 6%, which isn't much, but I get 5 runic out of it anyway. Uh, I could add fire and poison resistance as well if I want to. But um, I want to upgrade my uh, new gauntlets as well, so when I do that, I'm probably gonna be able to add another enchantment to it. Is this... This looks like a, a death ride, but I'm guessing this game doesn't do that. No, it doesn't. It kind of feels like the water level is gonna eventually drop down even further. But I can't really be sure on that account. So let's check out the cave down below here as well. It might be uh, containing a bit more loot as well. Or yeah, look, stuff like this. It looks like the water level is gonna drop down later on as well, but I wonder how exactly. Roy, what did I tell you about offering help? Don't. Correct. But can we this just- This is not a debate. You must learn focus. Our journey need be your only concern. But what if they can help us? That one seemed to know a little about the lake. And how does that help us with our goal? We won't know unless we ask. Starboard. The boat's right. Good. So yeah, indeed, I do agree with Atreus there. We won't know until we ask. Holy crap, what is this place? I can't war dock here, but over there, yeah, there's a flag. And another brazier. Okay, we're going through these rather quickly, actually. And if every one of those is going to upgrade my uh, handle, that's going to be nice. If you must. Hmm. First, let's check this area out a bit. I know there's a lot of stuff behind there, but I'm wondering... We can't explode it from over here. Which makes me wonder what is going to spawn here. It must be an enemy that explodes Thank as well. You. Okay, again Kvekia. Oh yeah, okay, 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 okay. Okay. I'm just gonna kill this guy. Oh fuck yeah, explodes. So I think... Okay, he just... Closed that gap really quickly, Jesus Christ, dude. And smack. Ah, explosion, 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 I know. So shield, guys. Jesus Christ, it keeps falling in my back. This is annoying. Oh. I'm ready. Um... And I'm gonna explode! Okay, so I wanna kill one close to here, right? No, 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 no. Come over here. Atreus, will you please stop? I mean, he's, you're doing a really good job, but. No, no. Okay. Hmm. That still doesn't well help me. Done, boys. Never thought I'd see a scrap like that again. What okay. do you want? To thank you. These dead reavers drowned me many winters ago. And I've been itching to see them get theirs. So you died after all the flooding? Indeed. I came to the Lake of Nine to pillage Tyr's temple. Oh, I an honorable man. The severity of the desolation. Have you seen other men? Living? A bearded one with tattoos. Only the one standing in front of me. <laughs> Thank you both for avenging my death. You're welcome. But... Useless. Well, we can't expect them all to know something useful. Hmm. So I'm guessing... Or maybe Atreus gets just explosive arrows. I can't get through whatever that is either, so it looks like... Those are actually poison bombs or something like that? I don't see anything else that I can do to get through this. And we can't throw our axe from the boat. Which is something I wanted to do a few times already, but... Oh, there's another... Yeah, there's another raven flying over there, but... 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to access that area to be able to go any further. Um, so that means we only have to free one more spirit for the quest to be concluded. So let's head in the boat. Maybe the next one will have more information. Indeed. Keep your expectations low, boy. Spirits are rarely useful. How do they even exist? When you sever a man from his life, it is not always a clean cut. So you've met other spirits? Yes. Many. What were they like? Annoying. <laughs> Annoying. Um, can we get up here? Oh, yeah, we can. We can. There's an elevator. It's really hard to see from uh, the water level. But let's get up. And light another brazier, I suppose. Because uh, now that we can read that. Ooh. What the? Uh, okay. And there's Pretty another good. realm there as well. Well, worth a shot. Kavakia? Yeah. No. Probably should do the realm there first. Are those things? No. It looked like they were exploding barrels, but apparently not. Let's just get another ship head. Ooh, good find. I'm assuming because all all of these has been have been uh, ship heads by now. So let's open this up. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Can I just? Oh, fuck. Yeah. Level 6. So, I've never been one to back down from a challenge. Hmm. This needs a different cipher than the one we have. Ah, okay. So that's why. So, I do want to try this again. I wonder how... Oh, ho, 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 ho. Yeah, the game just told me, these are optional, you can return to try them again. <laughs> and you know what? I'm not even going to try anymore. I'm not going to waste any more of uh, yours and mine time. So uh, let's just continue on. So we can't light the breaches because that's uh, apparently a different language than the one we've been uh, translating before. Uh, but I'm guessing we're, we'll still find another island. Because the, the benefit of doing this loop is also that we can actually get to the witch eventually. So uh, it's a nice benefit. God damn it. There's a, a raven here? over there. Shipwreck. Well, yeah. I wonder why it crashed. Okay then. No further explanation on that one. So another elevator, I think so. Yeah, with another item. Haxel, but wait. Ah, crap. Can't pull that down either. On the side, maybe? No, no, we can't do anything. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Take that back. Oh, no, wait. This is back to the witch, 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 witch. Wait. Um, so, we have been over there. Don't think there's actually anything interesting there. So, I'm going to head back on the bridge first. I'm going to pay a quick visit to the mountain, because... I feel like we... Yeah, we got a treasure map over there as well. Just to finish things off in the lake. So first off, the braziers. Can we read that Another now? Name. Yeah, we can. Rota. There we go. Third of the eight braziers lit. Uh, let's head back through here. Because I think there were actually braziers. Yeah, there were those standing stones over here. And maybe we can read that. I still can't read these. Damn it. Okay. Okay, just gonna quickly go to the mountain then. So while we're running around here, we might as well open up a few more chests that we've uh, left behind because we couldn't open them yet. There we go. More solid Svartalfheim steel and a symbol of cunning. That is nice. We still can't open that one, so we'll have to go back for that. So I just got the idea to first go to uh, Brock and see if we can't make any of that uh, Ancients armor because that sounds really really cool as well. Or upgrade our uh, already existing uh, Tears gauntlets. So, hi Brock! So yeah, the belt of the Ancients. Reinforced plates imbued with the power of an Ancient's hearts grants this armor resistance to all elemental damage, so 15% each. 6 strength, 27 defense, and 10 cooldown with a starting enchantment socket. So, uh, craft. Uh, and equip. 
I can upgrade my uh, grip of Tangiost. So uh, that is really nice with the lighter alloy. Because yeah, the versatile warrior's handle is not that good as I thought it was going to be. It's probably a good starting thing, but now that I have this thing, I might as well just, wow, double that. With the lighter alloy. There we go. That just gave us a really, really nice boost. Wait. Lost items. Oh. Yeah, I was thinking about that. We defeated the Soul Eater, which is kind of an Ancient as well. And we didn't get an Ancient's Heart of inch or Ancient's Rubble. Oh, and we got that over there. Ooh. So that means I can upgrade my uh, stuff. So Belt of the Ancients, I can actually upgrade that now, which is really, really nice. Two enchantment slots. And with that, I have my third Ancient's Heart. And I can actually... Ooh. I can actually craft the pauldrons of the ancient, the pauldron of the ancients as well. Yep, yep, can't just leaving that around, that can I? Only lose a bit of strength and one enchantment slot, but I got one extra on the belt, so I won't have enough to upgrade it anymore. Since I need another heart and one more solid Svartalfheim steel, the hex silver cost is actually pretty limited. But that is really nice. And it gives me a bit of combination of the tears, gauntlets, and the the rest of the armor. Because I only have three armor pieces. Need to remember that. I don't have a helmet or anything like that. You take care so, now. let's check out the enchantments now before we forget. I think I'm going to go with the defensive stuff uh, for now. So I, do, I did have the Courage and Defiance Crest equipped before that. But the Symbol of Truth, that is actually not bad, so... Might as well equip that. And then I think the two others on the belt, I can actually go for the um, the protection for fire. So 20% burn damage resistance. And then the other one, we can go for the poison resistance. There we go. There we go. Should help us out a bit, especially against uh, the elemental stuff, because I'm really losing a lot of health uh, for those. And I think... Yeah, Vitality is protecting against hit reactions, so yeah, interesting. Just gonna use the portal to head towards the mountain now. So apparently I can't actually do that, because the fast travel system doesn't allow me for some reason. Um, so that means I'm just gonna check out the final ghost, because I can actually see him on the map, which is really nice. So yeah, if you look closely over there, there's apparently another area that I haven't discovered yet. And there's a lot of green glowing orbs around here for some reason. Okay. What is this? Cliffs of the Raven. Okay. Just gonna double check that those guys aren't anything problematic. Oh, there's a dead ogre over here. Or troll? No, oh no, this is a giant. That is, that is cool. Any treasure over here? There's something buried here at least, so... That's just, yeah, just hack silver. Okay. I'm happy with that as well. I really, think this really happy is the with last that one. as well. Might yes, as well, indeed. Right? Yeah, might as well, indeed. Okay. Come here we go. I'm guessing this actually might have been the, the first time if I would have done this properly. Nope, I did hit him. Uh, smack, and one, two. There's that guy over there, but he's a lot weaker than the ones we've seen before. Um, slam. There we go, and... Wait, can I actually... No, he blocks that as well, which doesn't make any sense. There we go. Or not. Did I hear it? Yeah, I heard something else spawn. And that was a shock explosion! That was awesome. That was really cool. It's always cool that that gets triggered. Yes, yes, we'll speak with you. We came to this lake with a group of tradesmen, seeking refuge from the desolation. But how could we know it was even worse at the Lake of Nine? We cannot undo your mistake, Spirit. I know that. But I fear for my captain and crew. 
I believe they are still under the water. Will you find them for me? Is uh, there anything you can okay. offer us in return? I... I have little to offer. Oh. Well, I'm not sure... Wait! I died wearing a valuable family heirloom. It's yours, if you promise to find my crew. Deal. Thank you. Well, that's actually funny, because the old creators would have just ripped that off your corpse. Uh, okay. Unfinished business complete. Why didn't your but mom ever tell me about the desolation? Then we got a new I one then? speak for your mother, but it was never my concern. Nor should it be yours. Doesn't it concern us if everything around us is dying? Our only concern is reaching Jotunheim. Really? Then why are we exploring all these islands? The resources we find improve our equipment. If we stray from the path, it is only to prepare ourselves for the journey ahead. I can live with that if it means we keep exploring. And helping others. Just trying to get that raven over there. Oh, come on, that clearly hit him. Even higher. Laws of physics. There we go. Right on top of his stupid face. Um, There is more stuff here, though. I can actually clearly see... Oh, I can put... Atreus up there. Because that's a yellow thing. The, 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 the chest is glowing. Or so, there's something glowing yellow over there. So I think it's just a normal chest and I'm freaking out over nothing. But uh, I want to check that out anyway. Ah, it's one of those uh, mask chests. Open that up. Stab in the face. And we get... Or maybe the start of that other translation thingy. You know, symbol of defiance. Never mind. Again, excited over. Well, it's it's obvious loot, of course, but uh, eight out of nine ship heads, so we're still missing one. But there's more stuff around here. How do we? So I can't use my axe from around here. Ah, wait. Yeah, there's another another thing over there. Oh, okay. Another thing over there, so let's check that out. I don't know what those green glowing things are. So there's another one of those over there. But I don't know what to do with that. Uh, we did rescue all the spirits. Did we actually get another side quest from that? So the only extra quest we now have is reaching Muspelheim. Since we couldn't do that without heading towards uh, Alfheim. I think it's a good point to do that now, since we we kind of saw with these quests that we should do them as soon as possible. But uh, yeah, that might be something for the next episode. Then I'm gonna take a little break. I'm not really sure. This might be a bit of a shorter episode, but uh, yeah, we gotta have those as well. We finished all the the spirit side quests in the lake, and uh, yeah, we found out a few more things about something called the desolation which might be very interesting as well. And we got a few nice upgrades on the way as well. So thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, I hope to see you guys next time on God of War. Goodbye. <laughs>